Hey guys, and welcome back to Skies of Arcadia. When we last left off, we were just about to set out on our very own adventure. Uh, apparently, I've missed the moonfish. I'm not 100% sure where it is. I think he's here somewhere. I'm guessing... We can only actually see it as vase. So, uh, we'll have to come back and get that in a little bit. Anyway, we have adventure. Let's jump on our hastily bought boat. Set sail for Ducat's Island. Let's do it. Let's go. Now, what exactly are we going to find on this island? Well, that's going to be the interesting part. On the treasure map, it says, The dead will always watch over my treasure. And there's a skull here on the eastern part of the Valuan con continent. I wonder if that has to do with anything. Well, let's go have a little look, shall we? Now, we can't do much in this ship, like, at all. But we can have a little look over here. Now, remember it said something about a skull? I believe that's a bit of a hint as to where we're going. I like this little ship. It's cool. Oh, no. Uh, excuse me. Voss is going on. There we go. Excellent. Right. Head north. So the dead will watch over, it says. Now we're going to have to be a little bit careful here. A little bit on our best behavior. Because... We only have Ica and Fina here, but that's okay, because Ica. Oh, right! Because our party is smaller, we actually have less spirit power as well. Okay. I mean, that makes sense. Let's go for some Alpha Storm. See what that's going to do. I don't know if this is going to do a huge amount. Not really. Alpha Storm is kind of obsolete, to be honest. Oh! We got Cupel's uh, next ability, haven't we? Let's see what he does now. It turns into a giant dropping spike. That's pretty cool. We did it. Yeah, we did. Kind of. Just. So... Let's keep going. Um, not sure if that's our one. It kind of looks like a little volcano from what I can remember. Is it this one? Yep. This one? Well, we've got combat. Pretty sure that's not exactly what we were looking for. Oh, uh, God. I wonder if we can just... Use some magic. Can't quite use that one, sadly. All enemies on the screen. See, that damages everything. I guess we could also use some more magic. No, we can't, because we're out of spirit points. Of course we are. Let's see how Ica's magic... Okay, Ica's magic seems to be the way forward there. Although, Fina's magic will do significantly more damage now this bit can actually be pretty rough if you're under leveled luckily we are not under leveled so there we go that looks a little bit suspect doesn't it Ooh, do you hear what I hear I'm sure you do Where's that cham? Hey, there we go. We received a cham. Excellent. Right. I actually think we've got some other chams as well. Uh, let's have a look. Items. Yeah, we've got two chams. All right, cool. Okay, he's still a spike, but that's fine. Okay. I think that's pretty much all that's out here. Which is fine. Now let's head inside. Hey, why won't this door open? It won't even budge. There's something written here. It's an old language, but I think I can read it. 
When the two become one, the path will reveal itself to you. What's that supposed to mean? Why is Ducat being so stingy? It's not like any of his gold means anything to him anymore. <laughs> All right, calm down, Ica. Calm down, for God's sakes. You'll get your treasure. Well then, let's go find us some treasure. Okay, there are some directions on the map. To the north of the City of Sands, when the two pieces become whole, the way to the treasure will be known. I can't read anything before that, it's torn off. That's all it says. The City of Sands probably refers to the city that was here before Nasrad. I think it was called Oasis. So it's to the north of it, huh? Well, we can get there in no time with my ship. I'm a sailor without a ship at this point. There's no way I'll be able to reach my friends now. If we do find the treasure, I'd like to use my share to buy a ship. <laughs> I like you, Vase. You never give up. Very well. Off we go. Okay. But before we do that, I'm sure there's a moonfish to snag here. I'm almost certain of it. Oh! Where are you? I can hear the beeping. Where is it? I knew there was one here, I just totally forgot about it. Which is... Ah, there you are. There she blows. Come to Papa. Nice. Moonfish was caught. Excellent. Right, let me update my notes and I'll be right back with you. Okay, notes updated. Let's go. Let's go on an adventure. No, nope, that's not our ship. Let's get onto the right ship first because that seems like the logical thing to do. We've got this rather fancy ship here. Let's go. <clears throat> now, we need to go roughly in the same direction two girls went, which was over this way. Now, I think they have a slight... Actually, I, I can't remember if we're heading for the, exactly the same island, or if there's a slight variation, I'm not sure. Well, there's the island we were shipwrecked on. Sure as hell don't want to go back there. Yet. Oh, wait. Hang on. What's that? Ah, it's already marked on our map now. Excellent. This is most excellent. But of course, we've got to get through some battles first. Okay. Nothing too extreme here. Uh, we could use some magic, I suppose. Unleash that. That should get rid of them fairly handily. I hope. No. No, it didn't. Okay. I wonder if Gilda has any of his moves. Uh, he's been silent, so I guess it doesn't matter. Right, let's get through this as quickly and as painlessly as possible. At least, that's the theory. Nice. I wish they were all that easy. Yeah, me too, buddy. Me too. It's a shame we don't have Gilda for very long, but it is what it is, I suppose. Now, we're going to need to be saving up an awful lot of money soon, so... <laughs> well, is it soon? Well, it's reasonably soon, I suppose. Um, so, every little thing that we can find is going to be useful. And when I say we need to save up a, a lot of money, I mean a lot of money. Imagine all of the money that we have found in the game up until this point. Now, times it by a factor of five. Yeah, that's how much money we need. When I say an awful lot of money, that's exactly what I mean. It's kind of insane, but, you know. We're in a fairly healthy financial um, position at the moment. Which is good. Okay, let's go to Ducat's Island. So, Ica, Vase, 
Gilda and Fina are all on the same island, but notice something. We're in two different areas. Yeah, this is the rub of this area. It's pretty interesting, actually. Um, we have to work together between the two teams, although they don't know that they're working together. It's kind of fun. It, it's. I think that is that basically how you describe this game. It, it's just fun. It's just silly fun. Okay. This door is huge. I don't know how the two of us can open it. There's probably some sort of trick to opening it. Yep, yeah, yep. It looks like a big switch. What What was that? And the two girls are having the same issue. What was that? Whatever it was, it just opened the door. I don't know if that's good or bad. It's a good thing, Ica. I didn't touch anything, did you? Hmm, the map said something like when the two pieces come together. I wonder if anybody else is here. Yeah, <laughs> never mind. What are the chances of that? Yeah. Ica, what do you think we should do? I'm not sure how, but the door opened, and there's treasure inside. We should go. Yeah. She's a single... F she has a single focus, does our Ica. All she can think about is money. Money, money, money. So. Uh, we have a chest coming up, I believe. And it's actually an important chest as well. I, love, I really like playing as Ica. It's cool. It's such a really, like, interesting... Um, character model. I really like it. Okay, now this should... Yeah, there's a chest right here. Cool. You received the Skywing. Now, this is a, a new weapon for Ica. Uh, we're gonna need it because there's only two of them. And Fina doesn't really deal a lot of damage. So, let's go for equipment. So, she's got the Grendel Wing. How much better is the Skywing? It's a decent bit better. A boomerang shaped like a flying bird. It always returns, no matter how far it's thrown. Yeah. Okay, so the attack. It's quite high. But its hit is lower, so... That's uh, okay. Whoa, combat. What fresh hell do we have here? What beasties do we have? Well, that's kind of a big battlescape, isn't it? Well, okay. Ica's just going to attack. Actually, ah, we can see her new weapon. Yeah, looks all right, I suppose. Okay, so Ica just go for an attack. And, oh, we need to be a little bit careful, actually, thinking about it. Because although Fina has a lot of MP, we don't have any spare MP crystals, I don't think. Which is a concern. Because for some reason, Vase has kept all the swag. I'm not really sure why Vase kept all the swag. Like I say before, I think they should have like split it or something. But I guess it doesn't really matter that much. Okay. So, if we touch this, this actually switches our parties, which is the mechanic of the game. Right. <clears throat> now, we can... Oh, dear. Straight away combat. What are we fighting this time? Ooh, the hell is that? A wall rank. Wall rank? Okay. Whatever. Right, attack. Now, can we use... Oh, we can't use any special moves with Gilda because we haven't actually unlocked any with him. Um, and it's not really worth unlocking any with him, I don't think. He does have some cool ones. In fact, one of his special moves has the uh, single most damaging output against a single target. But because he's not really going to be part of um, our party for a while. I'm not going to bother. Now, we're going to have a boss fight here. 
<clears throat> Bane. Bane is here again. Um, this kind of sucks, but we don't really have many tactical options here. So we're just going to wail on him. Now, these characters, they're some kind of um, scavenger band. But luckily, he's not that tough. Well, I mean, that did hurt. So these guys are like a, a, a thieves guild of sorts, I guess. All right, let's use Cutlass Fury on his ass. Shouldn't be able to survive this. I say with utmost confidence. Well, I guess he did survive it, but he's basically screwed, so, you know. There's always that. Ooh, he, he's, he's got a bit of an arsehole to him. He hurts. But, you know, futile. Get out of here. That was easy. So, ooh, wow. Get a nice amount of gold from him. And a Zal seed. Take it. So we got a soul crystal. Not exactly sure what a soul crystal is. Uh, we also need to heal up. Uh, luckily, Vase has the bag of swag. So what, pray tell, is a soul crystal? Uh, I guess. Well, it's obviously going to be an item, but what kind of item? kind of item a soul crystal gilder's own yeah that's his standard handgun I, we could have actually bought him a new weapon i believe but again because he's not really in our party for that long i just don't really think it's that worth it soul crystal there we go valuable treasure sought by zivlin bane on ducat island i guess we can just sell it sell it then which is nice Anything that's a valuable treasure, we can sell. Cool. Right. Oh, hello. More combat. Okay. Let's just go for it. Yeah. I kind of, I don't really want these things to run away. I want to kill them because we, we're we going to need the money in the not too distant future. Because remember, friends, we don't really technically have a ship yet. That's a problem. I mean, technically, Ica has her ship, but that's not exactly battle worthy, is it? Level up. And as much as I love Gilda... Guild is awesome. Uh, he's only, sadly, a temporary character. A lever. I wonder what it's for. Well, flick that shit. And let's go. Yeah, unfortunately, it doesn't automatically switch us to Ica and Vina. We, uh, we have to do that ourselves. Oh, we got two of these things. Well, not actually as intimidating as they look, to be fair. Which is fine. I wish they were all that easy. Yeah, me too, Gilda. Me too. Okay. Cool. So, let's switch over to Ica. Now, she should... Uh, she's got a lever there, but before she fiddles with that, let's go get another chest. Hey, we got the Seculean crystals, which is nice. We like Seculean. I can't even say that. We like the healing crystals, damn it, alright? Um, anyway. Oh, dear. What are we fighting with the two girls? Ooh. Well, that's ugly. Kill it. You missed, Ica. You missed. I mean, honestly, you had one job. 
When Fina is out damaging you, uh, you, well, that was embarrassing. Hang your head in shame, woman. <sighs> okay. Anyway, let's flick the switch. Doors that open by themselves. Levers that we have no idea what they do. I really, really don't get this place. Yeah. Yeah. It gets worse. Okay. So, let's keep going. Now, obviously, we need to change back to the guys. And let's go. So we should... Oh, hello. Have glorious combat. Oh, wow. Got a few of them here, haven't we? Well, that's fine. Very tempted to spend a Moonberry to get one of Gilda's abilities, but... I just don't think it's worth it. Gilda is also fairly underleveled compared to the other guys, but that's fine. Hey, 2001 gold. Not bad. Right, okay. So, I guess. Ah, wait. So what do we do? Oh yeah, obviously. Stand on the switch. You moron. And that also activates everything on Ica's side. However, oh no, that's fine. Oh dear. Right, so we've got Maiden's Armor. Okay. Now, Maiden's armor, I'm guessing, is going to be fine for Ica. Female armor. Yeah, it's a good chunk. Oh, okay. Fina can wear it as well. Legendary armor given to the great female warrior. To a great female warrior by Decat. Well, he obviously had two... Um, Great female warriors, I suppose. Which is awfully convenient, don't you think? Light coat. It does put her hit down, though. But, you know. Hmm. I'm not sure. I guess it's only marginally. And it does put her magic up which is nice yeah fine all right now let's go back I don't think as much we can do here I'm sure there's a cham here somewhere if memory serves unless it might be Maybe if we switch to the guys. Ooh. Well, that's that closed. I wonder if the ladies are literally just up there. They probably are. So we've got a switch here. Right, one second. Let me just check my notes. Okay, cool. I don't think we've missed it yet, which is nice. Right. Let's give this a tug. So, yeah. The girls are literally just above us. Now. Where is it? Oh, that's the magic droplets. But we can't hold any more. Well, that's unfortunate, isn't it? Very unfortunate. Well, we're not going back that way, but hopefully Ica can carry on for us. Maybe she can fiddle with something. Let's see what we've got going on here. So we've got the magic do. 
Wait a minute. So. Uh. Apparently. Something here. What am I missing? Maybe it's in the next room, perhaps. Somewhere around here there's a cham. I'm sure of it. But. Maybe not, I guess. Okay. Well. I mean, if it's not there, it's not there, is it? It's that simple. Um, right. I guess if the worst comes to the worst, I can always load the save. Okay. Now. Do cats armor? Not bad. Now, is that any good? I'm guessing it probably will be. So we still got the golden armor on. Yeah, it's better. It is better. Oh, interesting. Gilda can wear that, but meh. Let's see if we've got anything that Gilda can wear that's better than what he has got. So, light armor worn by Gilda under his coat. Gilda likes to have fun, but he's no dummy. No, so everything else we have is actually not as good, which is kind of curious. Okay. So, we should be able to move on. At least, hopefully. Now, I'm pretty sure... Everything is going to... I think these doors shut after we walk through them something like that well it is what it is I suppose oh right good okay I was concerned that we might actually miss it then but I guess we won't right have at it ladies kill well that hurt Just lay it on them. Right, okay. So, I don't think it's here. I think it's on another ledge. Oh. Hello, we're going to have about 50,000 fights, I believe. Before we can actually get there. But that's okay. Shouldn't take too long. They look like weird rabbit things, actually. Yeah, kind of like a cross between a rabbit and like a badger or something. Ugh, so far from leveling. So far from leveling. But hey, it's all good. It's all good. We'll get there eventually. Now, what is in here? <coughs> hey, a vital seed. Well, okay. Well, we'll take that. Seems like something that we need. Yeah, man. There we go. Got another charm. Sweet. So, might as well pop that charm right now. No point in holding on to it. Ooh, the seed of a vital tree, which blooms under a full green moon. I wish all the seeds were put in one place, but... I guess we can't have everything. All right, let's keep going. More combat. More glorious combat. Right, what have we got? Okay. We fought these things before. They're nothing to worry about. Yeah, Mum. Keep fighting. Fight through the pain. Excellent.
Nice. So what do we have in here? Hey, Moonberry. Very nice. Very, very nice. And more combat. Yeah, mum. Let's get these overgrown Fidos down. I think we are, to be fair, overleveled for this area, which is fine. Didn't think the game was going to load then. Started to get somewhat nervous. Okay. Let's change. Change back to the guy. Oh. Uh. Ladies? Seriously? God damn it. Were they not on the door properly? Yeah, they're there. Why is that door not opening? Oh, wait. There's another chest up there. Oh, no. We, we idiot. We couldn't get it. Ah, wait. Hang on. If we can't get it, does that count? Does that count as us not picking it up? I wonder. Maybe. Let's use bugger. Can we get into a fight here? So we can just pop off some spells. I don't know if we can. Kind of hope we can. But it doesn't look like it, does it? The one time you want to get into a combat situation in this game, and it doesn't let you. Um, shit. Hang on. Let's try. Magic droplets. I mean, we can use one. One's better than none, right? Yeah, because my concern would be if we don't collect that chest, it won't count as it being used. Which is annoying. I think there was like four magic droplets in here. Ah, right. We did actually receive the four magic Okay, okay, so we wasted three, apparently, but that's fine. I don't mind wasting three, as long as the chest is collected. That's good enough for me. Okay. So, where are we going? Hmm. Interesting. <clears throat> so, we can't do anything more with the girls. That's definitely the way we need to get... And we're going to have combat. Apparently, we're already on half an hour, so... I think I'm going to end this episode here, guys. And when we come back, we're going to come back to this temple. To Cat's Island, and I'm gonna find out what exactly is going on here. Kind of curious to see if we actually get all this money at the end. I honestly can't remember because it's been so long, but I mean, hmm, unless we use all of that money for something coming up. Which may be true. I don't want to spoil it because although this is a, you know, million year old game. Uh, there are a lot of people that haven't played it. Hey, nice. So, anyway guys, I'm going to cut this one short here. Uh, well, it's not short, but I'm going to end this dungeon here. When we come back, uh, we are hopefully going to get to the end of this part. Because I was hoping to do it in one video, actually. But no matter. Anyway, guys, till next time.